um, uh, your excellencies, uh, uh, Mr. Sasaki, uh, dear um, uh, Vicky, thank you so much uh, for organizing uh, this uh, event. Uh, I think it is uh, extremely important to use uh, all the opportunities at our disposal uh, to bring together uh, Japanese and Greek companies to explore mutually, beneficially, um, um, mutually beneficial opportunities. And the reason why we arranged uh, this uh, trip uh, to Japan has to do primarily with the importance we assign towards strengthening the bilateral business relations between our two countries. Uh, as was pointed out uh, by Vicky, the Greek story is a very fascinating story of a country that is achieving a remarkable turnaround. If you look at where Greece was five or 10 years ago, uh, it would be difficult to envision that today, uh, Greece uh, would be one of the leaders uh, in uh, growth rates uh, in Europe, one of the countries that is at the forefront of both the green uh, and the digital transition. Uh, yet this uh, has happened, uh, and it has happened because it is uh, our firm commitment to change the underlying fabric of the Greek economy, to make it more extrovert, to open it to the world, to increase our percentage of exports uh, as a percentage uh, of uh, GDP, but also to make the country an attractive destination for foreign direct investment into Greece. And I think today there are many compelling reasons why a Japanese company would consider to invest in Greece. It is not just uh, our unique geographical location at the crossroads of three continents. It is not just the fact that we offer access to the largest single market uh, uh, in the world. It is also related to the fact that our government uh, is deeply committed to make uh, uh, the life and operations of every single foreign investor in Greece as easy and as seamless as possible. Uh, we are committed uh, uh, towards uh, delivering on concrete results. That was also one of the reasons why we have streamlined uh, all the investor relation operations within the Ministry uh, of Foreign Affairs. And I would uh, uh, like to take the opportunity uh, to congratulate uh, Deputy Minister Fragoyanis, uh, Mrs. Vicky Luizu, and the entire uh, team of Enterprise Greece for arranging uh, this, uh, this event. So uh, uh, when you look at Greece, uh, you see a country that uh, in our mind is offering uh, very interesting investment opportunities across the board in numerous sectors, not just tourism. Of course, Greece and Japan are world-class tourist destinations, but also in areas such as infrastructure, renewables, services, uh, areas related to the green and the digital transition. You will have an opportunity uh, to listen uh, in a bit to Minister Pialakakis uh, describing the importance we assign towards making uh, the country uh, a hub for digital transformation, and I think we have already achieved significant progress uh, in these results. So I do hope uh, that uh, this forum will be an opportunity for uh, Japanese companies, Japanese government agencies to find out more uh, about Greece. Uh, but I'm also sure that this visit as a whole has provided an opportunity for Greek companies to meet Japanese com companies and to mutually uh, explore uh, beneficial business opportunities. After all, as governments, we can only be catalysts uh, of uh, investment. We cannot uh, um, generate this investment on our own. We can create the proper uh, conditions uh, for Japanese companies to invest in Greece and for Greek companies to uh, increase uh, their footprint in the Japanese market. And I do hope uh, that uh, this uh, forum uh, will offer uh, us the opportunity uh, to do exactly that. Uh, I wish uh, you uh, success uh, uh, in your meetings uh, and deliberations today. Uh, and uh, I am uh, convinced uh, that uh, this visit uh, will be a game changer in terms of our bilateral relationship with Japan. We had the opportunity yesterday with the Prime Minister uh, of Japan to discuss a wide um, array of topics, uh, uh, but also to sign a new strategic partnership agreement that I think will take our relationship uh, to, to the next level. So again, um, uh, uh, wish you all the best uh, 
uh, in your discussions, and uh, hopefully uh, we will see uh, more uh, interest by Japanese companies uh, to invest uh, in Greece, but also a greater uh, interest uh, by Greek companies to penetrate the Japanese markets. After all, uh, we should not uh, forget that uh, um, Greek ship owners um, started building uh, their first ships in Japan immediately after the Second World War, uh, and uh, in their own way, I think, have also uh, contributed uh, to the phenomenal success uh, of the Japanese economy. Again, arigato, and thank you very much for your attention.